Welcome back. A college education can take you a long way. For a former UTEP women's basketball player, it not only took her home, but also into superstardom in her native country of Bolivia. Now she's trying to use her celebrity status for a greater good. ABC 7's Paul Sicala has her story. Picture this. A model basketball player who's also a real life model. Former UTEP forward Claudia Lampe Porras. The Bolivian basketball beauty has left our border to continue her life as a famous model in South America. I need to help my country out as I was doing when I was living here. More on Porras' budding modeling career in a bit, but first, the humble beginnings that led her to El Paso. Bolivia is considered one of the poorest countries in Latin America. Here, good jobs are scarce, and those that do find work oftentimes put in 10 to 12 hours a day and only walk away with a few dollars. My country is just a poor country, and we don't like basketball that much, but I love it. Whew. It's no secret, the most popular sport here in Bolivia and in all of Latin America is soccer. And as you can see, most of the basketball courts that you'll find right here in Bolivia are oftentimes old and run down. And it's actually more common to see people playing soccer on them. We don't get to go and play in like big gyms like you guys have in the States. Bent off in broken backboards and all, this is the best basketball court Porras' hometown of Santa Cruz, Bolivia has to offer. We don't have places to go and do sports. We don't have money, we don't have anything. It was just so hard. Still, Porras found a way to overcome the odds, make the Bolivian national team, and earn a scholarship to the University of Texas, El Paso. From UTEP, I got so many things. I, got, I miss that place so much. And why wouldn't she? In her two years in El Paso, Porras and the Miners averaged a school record 25 victories. So I wish I could add over four years. Her senior season, Porras and her teammates also advanced to the round of 32 in March of 2008. All of our kids on our team liked her. Um, and obviously, I think everybody that came to the games uh, enjoyed watching us play and they enjoyed looking at Claudia. And thanks to you, Teb, I just, I got my degree in business administration. I got, I achieved all my dreams. One of those dreams was to also return to Bolivia as a different type of model, a role model. I remember my childhood here and I love when I was dreaming to play in ball somewhere else. So now Porras gives back by coaching and mentoring kids who also aspire to reach high, rise up and follow in her footsteps. Nine-year-old Sheila wants to follow Porras' advice. And Katarina tells us she hopes to be a great player like her. As scores of Bolivian children line up for their own photo with Porras, they say she's simply magnificent. And when Porras isn't shooting hoops, photographers are shooting her, literally. Claudia Lampe. Porras has become one of the most well-known models in South America, often strutting down the runway to help raise money for Bolivian charity. We do the fashion shows to help people. We don't get paid. Standing tall at six feet two inches, Porras definitely stands out in a crowd. She's so much of a celebrity in Bolivia. La cadena de televisión ABC. When the local media got wind, a station from the U.S. was profiling Porras, they sent their own crew to cover us. Ella jugaba en El Paso, Texas. Qué maravilla, qué maravilla. As a model, Porras also has one of the most prestigious gigs in South America, representing the popular Bolivian beer, Paseña. One of the biggest sponsors of the country's world-renowned carnival. Bolivia might be considered a poor country, but it's definitely rich in culture. Thousands of people make their way every year right here to Oruro for the big festival. Carnaval. Oruro. So you're probably wondering, two years after playing Division I ball at UTEP, can Porras still hoop it up? I definitely learned the hard way. Porras still has game. You get the picture? From Bolivia to El Paso, Texas, to a brief stint as a pro basketball player in Europe, Claudia Lampe Porras is definitely a model for success in more ways than one. 
Reporting from Bolivia, Paul Sicala, ABC7. Poor Paul. Poor, poor Paul gets all the hard assignments around here. I don't know what we're going to do about that. We should mention, though, that he did that while he was on vacation, didn't he, Jorge? Took time out of his own schedule.